What is going on guys? Welcome back to another Horizon Zero Dawn gameplay video. And as you guys can see, we're trying to enter the Royal no Palace. No one goes into the palace wherever. without an invitation. Okay, and they're not letting us in. Oh, we gotta talk to this idiot right here. Okay. Greetings, Aloy. I am known as Blameless Mirad. Please come with me. You're needed for an important consultation. What do you mean? Where's Erend? He's inside, attending the Sun King, where we should be without further delay. Follow me, please. All of these people are here to see the Sun King. Yes, and each has come to ask a favor of him. Unpleasant, but that's politics. The Sun King is eager to meet you, the machine tamer with a curious eye for detail. It's all very intriguing. I'm not here to intrigue you. Too late. First, the Oseram gets special treatment. So if you guys want to know what happened to this guy's sister, stick around. Hopefully, we'll figure it out in this one. This guy's walking slow for me. Is this a Sunday stroll? Are we going out here? Or Ignore them. Nobles are like children who whine when they don't get a second helping of dessert. What's the Sun King like? The most important thing is what he isn't like, his father. I think you'll find him to be a reasonable man. Aloy of the Nora. She who sees the unseen. Welcome. It would seem you have done me a great service. Erend, tell her what you found. I, I checked Ursa's tomb. You were right, Aloy. The body is missing a scar below her right knee. I gave it to Ursa when we were kids, fighting over a toy sword. If the body is not Ursa's, then we must assume she is still alive. And I will not abandon her. We only know she was taken, not who took her. I can help with that. Ursa has an enemy among the Osara. A warlord named Durval. Impossible. Every clan in the claim has been hunting for him since the liberation. He has to be dead by now. No other Osoram had the motive and ingenuity to lure Ursa into this trap. I expect to find him lurking somewhere near the border. I've already sent an agent to investigate. He'll be waiting for word from us at the marketplace in Pitchcliffe. I can't move troops to the border without provoking the Osoram. But I could send a few vanguardsmen. And perhaps an exceptionally gifted Nora as well. Errant, Murad. Let me discuss it with her privately. Oh, okay. I don't know what kind of moves you got, but you got chill, I hate to impose further after all you've done, but this is a matter of great importance to me. It sounds like Ursa means a lot to you. Without her Asaram vanguard, I would not have been able to liberate Meridian and end my father's brutal reign. Since then, it has been difficult to maintain peace between our tribes. But Ursa has a way of making her people see reason. So you see, I need her back at my side. And quickly. Who is Durval, exactly? To understand Durval, you must first understand my father. He truly thought of himself as a sun god. His mind was broken. He believed that blood sacrifice would solve, well, everything. So he raided the other tribes for victims, especially the Asuran. Durval fought back. He crafted powerful weapons and rallied his people. My father responded with the ultimate cruelty. He captured Durval's wife and daughter, and sacrificed them in the sun ring. Jesus, this guy's a savage. My God. I'd like to ask you something about the Sundom and its politics. By all means. They call you a sun god who killed his own father in order to unite the tribes in harmony. Is any of it true? They say you can see the invisible, split an arrow at 50 paces, and tame machines at a glance. How much of that is true? It's not too far off. Well, 
I would like to unite the tribes in harmony, but you saw how many courtiers I have to deal with first. Maybe next week. Okay, buddy. Quite a place you've got here. You can almost see the little people below the mesa. You don't approve? Well, I have a secret for you. Neither do I. But we must be patient. Change won't come in a single sunrise. But will it happen at all, while men live in palaces? It might. Eventually. If people like you help me bring it about. Ah, oh, he's a slick talker, isn't he? Your politics seem very complicated. The Asaram are friends, but enemies too? I couldn't have liberated Meridian without the help of Ursa and her Asaram freebooters. Many of them have settled here. But the Eldermen of the Asaram clans and the claim have become jealous of their success. So have many Karja nobles. It's a volatile situation, especially given the fact that my father raided the Asaram for years. Ursa helps keep the peace, promising a future based on mutual gain. But some, like Durval, will never let go of their venom. Can't really been north man killed my wife and my daughter. I don't know. I'll probably burn his kingdom to the ground. What can you tell me about the Shadow Karja? What do they have to do with Ursa? They are remnants of my father's regime, holding out at the fortress of Sunfall to the west. Like him, they care only for domination and seek to draw upon the power of the sun by spilling blood in its name. Since Ursa helped me take this city from them, they were perfect scapegoats. Durval knew this, of course, and planned it well. Okay. I need to get going. I know. Well, they say kings should never beg. But please, help me find Ursa. Who says that? Well, Murad, for one. Don't hesitate to ask him or Aaron if you have further questions. Okay, buddy. Seem like a decent king, but I may be back for your head, so don't try anything slick. I guess we're where are we going? We have a long road ahead of us. Okay, let's see if we can fast travel there. Fast travel. It is the way to go. Mm. Wow. Yep, we have a long road ahead of us. Okay, so let's see how much of that we can eliminate. We can go as far as here. And then just cut through here. Okay, cool. Boys, ooh, sandstorm. Okay, don't die on me. Let's. Okay, let's grab some some herbs. No, none of these are healing. These are cheap. That's good. Go back before help. I'm gonna cut through this pathway. I'm gonna pull this little bitch out with a few more of these things for the road. I don't know what might. Kick my ass in the way. Alright, let's go. It'd be nice if we get the ability to override some more machines soon. But this one is not too far away, so it's okay. Sand in my throat. It burns. <laughs> I'm not even going to say what I was going to say. <laughs> yeah, that is terrible. Game is the ever-changing weather. 
so even if you visit somewhere multiple times it will always kind of look different <laughs> because sometimes oh, it's useful. snowing raining sandstorms all kinds of stuff really love that Okay, so there's a safe point over here, so that's great. That means next time I don't have to walk as far. Okay, good. Okay, sandstorm's kind of clearing up. Nice. Can't be too prepared. Never be too prepared, that's for sure. So that's how it goes, you know. And we got a safe point right here, so that's great. What is that? And that is a Ravenger. Weaknesses tier. Alright, so we're gonna have to fight that for sure. Quietly.
<laughs> not this mad thing. Ravenger lens, why do I have so many of those? Special powers that one's for. Not even sure what's for right now. Hmm. Whatever. Not sure what that's for. I hate leaving stuff that's not common behind, but whatever. And that was way harder than it should have been. I need to get real armor. Looks like a snap ma. What is that? Mm -hmm. There's two of them. Alright, cool. I'm gonna walk up here and try to avoid combat, but if it happens, it happens, you know. Okay. Good. because I think that's just a... Oh crap, nope. That's a shell walker. Okay. It's only one, so... That's fine. Uh, I shut off the wrong one. I should have shut off the shield. I thought that was the shield. Thank you. 
you win and let you die first, but it's okay. He's still your friend because he's gonna die with you. It's not like he's gonna Shell one. Oh, resource, that's what's for. Okay. Inventory, resource, okay. Uh, okay, so next time I go back to this, I gotta sell some of this stuff. Should have brought a cart. Yeah, I really should have brought a cart. Oh, I thought that was medicine. Whatever. We're almost there, boys. As long as I don't stop to kill anything. We should make it by tomorrow. <laughs> the fox? Oh, fox me. <laughs> fox bones. Making some foxy soup, guys. You might need that. Yeah, you don't need really much. Never know when I might need these. Where is this guy? Oh, cold as winter steel today. Yeah, it's cold, isn't it? But I can't really tell because it looks like you're not wearing any clothes. So I don't, I don't get you, bro. You're a different breed. Complain about the cold, and you are outside naked. Word is, you know I like to tinker a bit. Keep it up. Someday, maybe you'll get good at it. <laughs> Alright, so we're almost there. This must be pitch close. Murad's agent should be at the marketplace by now. Boss around guard. So you would I boss around. Oh, I passed him. A merchant too. No sign of Marat's guy. He's had plenty of time to investigate. We'd better look for him. Damn right. Alright, just give me a sec. Actually, no, I'll use the merchant later. Nah, I'll use it now. Don't want to miss out on losing anything. That was an awkward position to go into the, <laughs> the story.
that's good enough. More tracks. I think someone followed whoever we're following. That sounds bad. Guy. Durval's thugs must have made it. Maybe because he found something. Look at this. I think he drew a map with his own blood. Right. Those kind of maps you know you better follow. That this... might be Pitchcliff. He marked a spot to the north. Could be Durval's location. And my men are waiting outside of town. I'll grab them and meet you there. This guy's a legend. This guy is a legend. I salute you, sir. Like. Dying and then writing a message in your own blood? Legend. Legend, guys. Legend. Alright. I'm ready. Gotta be. for me. I'm always priority number one. My feelings are hurt now. Like I'm hurt that you So far away.
kill them all already. I'm forgetting stuff, guys. Pretty sure there was another one. It's okay. If there was, we'll find him soon enough. What the heck is that? There's that blue light over there. Oh, what the heck is that? Oh, it's a long leg. The, the things I hate the most in this. Actually, I don't know. It's between them and the freaking sawtooth, man. Okay, no more sneaking. Come, I'm waiting for you. My nemesis. <laughs> Fifty by now, but I'm at level twenty-one, so it's okay. <laughs> Low and quiet does it. Think you're slick. You think you're slick. Ah. Ah. 
was is left. Nothing? Okay, cool. Duval, I mean. <laughs> Isn't that, that guy from One Piece? Yeah, that's his name, Duval. <laughs> Sanji's look alike. <laughs> Need to reopen those. I don't I barely use the fucking war ball. about to finally find a guy I think that killed Ross. I'm not sure, but I feel like he has something to do with Ross's death. So I'm gonna make sure he burns. Looks like they've been chained up. Durval's a tinker. He probably experiments on them all, or strips them for parts. Maybe I can use them to make some trouble. I'll go in first. Hold off until the fighting starts. All right. We've got your back. <laughs> all right. So, boys, we're going to wrap this one right here. And we're going to pick it up next time and see just how this encounter turns out man because i know with me the fighting is going to start immediately and i'm probably going to die but stay tuned guys cliffhanger right here thanks for watching and i'll see you guys next time be light out soon. peace love <laughs>